Pro Tools Studio and Ultimate users have the ability to export portions of a session. This allows you to make a timeline selection and only have that portion saved into the new session. This setting is only active if you have a timeline selection made before opening the Save Copy In window. Opening the Save Session Copy In window, you have several options. With Selected Timeline Range only checked, this will save only the clips that fall within the selected range. If only a portion of a clip is selected, the exported session will contain the edited version of the clip. The entire file will be copied, but will show only as trimmed within the selection. This option will only include clips that are referenced by the edit window. This includes alternate playlists, unless the main playlist only checkbox is checked. Selected tracks only can also be enabled to just include the tracks wanted for export. All ruler data, including song start, is not trimmed and will remain in the copied session. As well, the session start is not affected. Automation anchor breakpoints are always written at the start and end of the selection on playlists that include one or more written breakpoints. Optionally, and by default, anchor all automation playlists can be enabled, which will add breakpoints to automation playlists that don't have any breakpoints already written. This ensures the values are anchored if tracks are imported into another session, and that only automation within the specific imported range will be affected. 